All right, everybody, we're back. Gary made it back about time. I mean, he'd been here the last couple of videos, but I got a new glass. Look at that. I got this at MM Beer. I went there today to the new store. Check that out, man. I got all kinds of stuff. And I got a six pack of this for $11.79 plus tax. And they said it was very good and they liked it. If you don't go there, I'm going to. You got to go there if you're ever in uh, the eastern side of Pennsylvania and you got to check them out. But what today we have? Heavy Seas Beer. I don't know if they're the Heavy Seas Brewing or not, but Heavy Seas Beer Chocolate Volcano Chocolate Dessert Stout, 12 ounces or 355 milliliters of Baltimore, Maryland. I went out there a few years ago where I got, I tried, I got, um, what the heck did I get? Lone Brow. I got Lone Brow out there. Holy crap. Anyways, what is this? 9%? I've never bought it if I knew it was 9%. No, I would have bought it. Chocolate Volcano. Mm -mm -mm. Independent Craft. All right. Since 1995. Wow. That's a pretty long, long time. Yeah, you go to hsbeer.com and check them out. Crafted in Scotland. It's a 16-ounce glass. has a thing up there. That's, that's like etched in there. No, that's painted on there. I wish I could etch stuff like that. Anyway. Right, today we're going to talk about denominations of bills. You know, like, like a $1 bill, $5 bill. Who's on it? And we're going to talk about it. Everybody knows the number $1 bill is... Abraham Lincoln, no wait, George Washington. George Washington, do you know George Birthington's wash day? No? All right, wow, that's a head on that. That's a dark head. A dessert style, 8%, I said 8%, a 9%, I was wrong already, I forgot. Jeez, I had a good time over there, man. I went in the store, just, uh, they're good people. Chocolatey. Ah, number two. I would have never guessed. Number two, the two dollar bill. Thomas Jefferson. Oh yeah. Okay. It's not too much bitter. Like a lot of dark chocolate beers, you get a lot of dark chocolate. That and it's really bitter. This is horrible. No, <laughs> this is very good. Yeah, that's, this is one of the better chocolate beers I've ever had. Now, my favorite chocolate beer was Flying Monkey Chocolate Manifesto, and they had it in the cans. I've seen it on the shelf. That's the, That stuff is fantastic. The $3 bill, is RuPaul. No, there's no such thing as a $3 bill. The $5 bill, everybody knows that. Abraham Lincoln. The $10 bill, Hamilton, Alexander Hamilton. Number the $20 bill, Andrew Jackson. And this is the funny part. The $50 bill, Ulysses, Ulysses S. Grant. And remember when they were taking all the, the statues down and everything of, of Grant and everything like that? because he was from the South and it's offensive and everything. <laughs> you still take that 50? I wonder if you do. Number 100 dollar bill would be the old Benjamin Franklin and he wasn't a president. People think he was a president. President? No, he was never a president. Uh, the 500, I would have never guessed. William McKinley. William McKinley. I'm starting to get a little warm a little warm. It's, it's very thick. That's a very good beer. I'm going to give one of these to uh, George and then uh, got Brandon at work. By Jolly Jets. That is very, very good. I like that. Okay, $1,000 bill. Uh, again, I would have never, never guessed it. Grover Cleveland. Man, I like this shirt. The $5,000 bill, 
I didn't even think they had a five thousand. I didn't think they they made it. Mean, who who walks around with five thousand dollar bills? Don't at, at this point, don't you just like have it have it like everything computerized? Where okay, I'll give you five grand or whatever. I don't know who. Yeah, I go. Oh my God, who I don't know who walks around with a thousand or even a five hundred dollar bill. Five thousand dollar bill is James Madison, and I'm going to give this one a D for delicious, but I'll give it an A. I'm going to give this one an A for chocolate beer. Now nine percent. Now would I order this in a bar? Oh heck yeah, I would. Only one, because at nine percent. Yeah, you'll end up naked sometime during the night after a few of these. Yeah, and it won't be pretty. Man, that coats that glass like cough syrup. Very good, very freaking good. Not carbonated. Not a lot of carbonated. It is dark. Shut up and keep going. This this guy, ten thousand a ten thousand dollar bill. Sam, Salmon Chase, Salmon Chase, is that the Chase Bank? All the way. And the last one is a one hundred thousand dollar bill. Take a guess. Take a guess. Woodrow Wilson, Woodrow, Woodrow Wilson on a hundred thousand dollar bill. Now I have, uh, I have a Confederate fifty. It was. I took it to a person who dealt with money. He says that is real, but it's in really bad shape. I got it from my dad. I don't know where he got it from. And I have a certificate. It's a big certificate of a, a gold certificate. And I've had it. We found it at a house that we used to live in, Liberty. Before we bought our old house back and moved into there, it was a certificate to pay on band uh, bear pay on demand one million dollars in gold. It was like a gold certificate, and it has presidents and stuff. I don't know if it's real or if it's fake. I I haven't seen anything on. I googled the hell out of it, and I can't find if it's real or not. So that being said. I got a I got a few beers from their place, man. Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! I can't wait to go back. They are so fun. They are nice, very nice people. He was busy taking inventory because he was getting they were getting stuff shipped in, and he's busy, doing, you know, doing that stuff. And Terry is so nice, and they're just great people. Anything on the inside of this cap? Nope. That's all right. Yeah, I like this beer. I like this beer a lot. Yes. Chocolate baked potato. Okay, I think we're done here, folks. And I'm going to give you one more. It doesn't have to do do with dollar bills. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? What the heck is going on here? Uh, okay, here's a here's a weird one for you. Water boils at 212 degrees Fahrenheit, at 100 degrees Celsius. For every 550 feet above sea level. The boiling point is lowered by one degree Fahrenheit. That's weird. So eventually, you get up high enough. Will water boil? How high would you have to get for water just to start boiling at normal room temperature? I'm not doing that kind of math. I'm not that brainiac kind of guy. But anyways. Yeah, this is a fantastic beer. I liked it, and I'm glad I got it. It's warming me up, and I will see you in the next one. And remember, know when to say when, because it, it's expensive, man. Cheers.